The OSF makes integrating your various research workflows easy, and now you can connect them all in one place. We are always developing add-on connections to services that you already use. Some add-ons, like two-factor authentication, are applied to the account as a whole from the account settings page. Other add-ons, like the wiki or the ability to link to external pages, are applied in the settings of the individual projects. Most add-ons, including GitHub and Dataverse, are authenticated for your entire account but then applied separately to individual projects. The easiest way to add them is to go straight to your project and navigate to the settings page in the gray toolbar. Find select add-ons. Here, you'll be able to see a list of the add-ons that you can add to the project. Select the add-ons that you want to use. This opens a dialog box that will tell you about the specifics of the add-on. Click OK and then click Submit. You will now see a box labeled Configure Add-ons appear beneath the Select Add-ons box. Click on Create Access Token and then input your credentials. This will both authorize the add-on for your entire account and apply the add-on to your project. Once the add-on is authorized, you'll be able to choose how you want the add-on to interact with your project. For example, you may have some photographs of your research subject that you want to associate with your work. You can select the specific Dropbox folder containing these images to link with your project. Just pick a folder you want to incorporate and click Submit. Now, you will be able to see and interact with your Dropbox files in your project. Any changes you make to the files from the OSF will be reflected in your Dropbox folder, and vice versa. You can also authorize add-ons on your account settings page. Navigate to your account settings by clicking on the gear icon on the top right of your screen. Here, you can authorize all of the add-ons for your account. You only ever have to do this once, so if you authorized it for a different project, you don't have to do it again. But don't forget, even though it's authorized for your entire account, you still have to apply the add-on to each project individually.